Hello and welcome. In today's video I will be talking about Manta Network's Squad Game. Squad Game is the name of Manta Network's token event which is exclusively available for Manta Network and Calamari Network community. Also thank you very much if you decide to subscribe to this channel. So after community token events from Akala, Build Akala and Moonbeam take flight, there is another exciting opportunity for community members to get native tokens of one of the biggest projects of Polkadot ecosystem, Manta Network. On Wednesday, Manta Network sent emails to all Manta and Calamari Network ambassadors as well as to Calamari Crowdloan participants who contributed at least 0.2 Kusama in Kusama Parachain Auction. So if you are Manta or Calamari Network Ambassador, or if you contributed at least 0.2 Kusama to Calamari Crowdloan, check your emails, because you have probably been invited to participate in this Manta Network token sale. So it is simply great that participating in Calamari's Crowdloan brought us another benefit, this Manta Network token sale, where eligible participants will be able to purchase Manta tokens for a very low price. Unfortunately, if you did not participate in Calamari Network Crowd Loan and you are not an ambassador, you will not be eligible to participate in this token sale. Now, there will be two rounds of this sale. Round 1 will start November 10th and the next day, November 11th, the second round will start. Each round will last 24 hours. Now let's check specifically who is eligible to participate in this token event in the first round and in the second round. So qualified participants for round 1 are mainly Calamari Crowdloan participants that have contributed at least 0.5 Kusama and highly active ambassadors plus all these other groups. So again, if you know you have contributed to Calamari at least 0.5 Kusama, you are eligible for this token sale. Now for the second round, whole new group of participants will be eligible, but mainly all round 1 participants, then Calamari Crowd Loan participants, who contributed at least 0.2 Kusama, and then all Telegram and Discord community members as of September 1st. So if you contributed to Calamari Crowd Loan less than 0.5 Kusama, but at least 0.2 Kusama, you are eligible to participate in the second round. Now let me note here that all participants in round 1 will have a guaranteed allocation. That means as long as you get whitelisted and you pass KYC verification process, you will receive a guaranteed allocation of MA tokens in this first round. In the second round, all participants will receive allocation on a first come first serve basis so allocation of MA tokens in this second round is limited and is not guaranteed. All tokens that will not be sold in the first round will be available for the sale in the second round. So now once you have received this invitation email from Manta Network, the next step for you is to get on that whitelist. To get whitelisted, you can either click on this pre-registration for crowd loaners button in your email or you go to squadgame.manta.network, you click on event details, then round specifics, and here you click on this link pre-approve Manta Network, and here you simply enter your email address, you can also enter Twitter and Telegram handle, but it's optional. Once you fill up your email address, click on this sign and submit button, and you will be prompted to sign each field that you filled with your Kusama wallet. Then you simply enter your Kusama wallet password, you sign the transaction and you get whitelisted for this token sale. Once you submit your email address and get whitelisted, you will receive this notification successfully registered. Now you can just wait to receive further instruction from Manta Network by email. Then the last step before the actual token sale will be this KYC verification process probably as always on Tokensoft platform. That KYC verification will open on October 19th and will be open until November 9th. Now the specifics for this token sale. The total amount of MA tokens allocated will be 80 million tokens, which is 8% from the total MA token supply. The first round will start on November 10th and the second round on November 11th, each round lasting 24 hours. Now there will be no vesting, but 40 days lockup period for those purchased MA tokens from the moment Manta Network is launched. Therefore, Manta will first need to win a parachain slot auction on Polkadot, 
Then there will be that launch process lasting probably several weeks and once they fully launch Manta Network Mainnet, we will have to wait 40 days to receive our MA tokens. And based on this info here, there will be set low maximums of tokens available for purchase as well as low minimums so that community members can participate with smaller amounts. Tokens accepted for payments will be ETH, USDC and USDT. Now what will be very interesting is the price of MA token in this token sale. It will be announced probably shortly before the event starts. Now we know that the Manta Network total token supply will be 1 billion tokens, so the total supply will match Polkadot's total supply as well as Akala's and Moonbeam's, as all these networks will have 1 billion total token supply. The price of one ACA token in that built Akala token sale was 98 cents, which was quite high, but the price of one Glimmer in Moonbeam's take flight was only 25 cents. So now considering that Manta Network will have the same total token supply as Akala and Moonbeam, that is 1 billion, and considering that Manta Network is quite a big project, perhaps belonging amongst top 8 on Polkadot Network, I would expect the price to be less than Akala's 98 cents. After all, Akala is simply much bigger project than Manta, but at the same time I would expect more than those insanely low 25 cents of Glimmer token. So my price estimate for MA token is between 40 to 60 cents, probably somewhere around 50 cents. I think 50 cents would still be a great deal and the price of MA token after listing might be around 2 dollars, which would still make 4 multiples. Anything under 40 cents will be an excellent deal, but if the price of MA token is over or close to 1 dollar, I will consider very carefully if I participate in this token event. So in conclusion, if you are eligible to participate in this Manta token event, make sure you get whitelisted and I can see there is an update for that deadline of whitelisting until October 18, so you still have two days. And then you will receive further instruction regarding KYC verification process by email. If you have any questions about Manta token event, please let me know in the comments and also feel free to join our Cryptozilla Telegram group. The link is in the description of this video. Thank you very much for watching and bye bye.